Hey guys, you can't love God and not minister. Got a minute? Now, defining minister is pretty much taking anything that you're getting from God and you're pouring it out to other people. In fact, I have a video back a while back called uh, What is Ministry? So just if you have any questions about that, go and check it out. But to do ministry means that you are going out and you are helping people. You're helping people know who God is. You're helping show God's light. And this act of service is a way that we love God. Jesus in a parable said this, Then the king will say to those on his right, Come, you who are blessed by my father, take your inheritance, the kingdom prepared for you since the creation of the world. For I was hungry, and you gave me something to eat. I was thirsty, and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger, and you invited me in. I needed clothes, and you clothed me. I was sick, and you looked after me. I was in prison, and you came to visit me. So these righteous people afterwards, Jesus says, they ask, like, when did we see you hungry? When did we give you food? When did we visit you in prison. And the king says to him, whatever you've done for the least of these brothers of mine, you have done directly for me. And so whenever we don't minister, whenever we don't share the light and share the love of God, then we're not loving directly on God. We can't love God and not do that or not be open to do those things. Now, everyone has their own limitations on what they can and cannot do. And whenever you deal with God in that manner, that's on you too. But I know that God has called us all to minister, all to share the love. A lot of times we don't do because we don't think we can or we don't, secretly we don't want to. That's not the heart of God. If you want to love God, then you have to rub elbows with the people around you in need. You have to be one that meets needs for, of other people and blesses them. And that need could be physical. Like a lot of the examples here, it could be just a lending an ear to someone that needs to speak and needs to speak and you can just listen to them and maybe it might be just encouraging them. Maybe it's, you know, going up and just saying, hey, look, I've been praying for you. I just want to follow up. How are you doing? But no matter what, we need to expand our realm in order to be able to reach people, just like in this story, people that it didn't, they weren't brothers and sisters to them. They were just people. So are you loving God? Are you doing ministry? Or is something getting in the way? Thanks for taking a minute.